So for a while, I've been looking for a face mill for my small desktop CNC machine, but I've only come across the industrial size with the RH shafts or the spoil board surfacing bits, which technically could work. After a bit of research, I found this gentleman, Chris, who had his own version of a 25 millimeter face mill. So I brought it into Fusion. I shortened the body, shortened the shaft, and then shrunk down the shaft size to be a 6 and a 6.35 millimeter shaft. After that, I brought it into my Carbera Air 4th axis and took off all the material. Then I ran a finishing pass on it, and then I drilled the holes just so they're as precise as can be. Then I popped the part off and tapped the holes for M3 screws. And then I threw in some APMT 1604 inserts on it. And for my first cuts, I was running a 0.5 step down at 500 millimeters a second feed rate with an 8K RPM on the spindle, but it was introducing a lot of chatter. So I bumped up the spindle speed to 12,000 RPMs while bumping up the feed rate to 1,000 and the step down, I made it a 0.1 instead of 0.5 millimeters, which definitely helped out the finish on it, but I only got a few passes on it. So still a lot of experimenting to see speeds and feeds and step down. But also running a 25 millimeter facing bit on a small desktop CNC machine is in uh, is impractical, especially the bit being aluminum. So eventually I'll get it made out of tool steel, but for right now this is doing its job and I'm only doing lighter cuts just to finish it off and bring it into tolerance. And if you are interested in making your own or getting it made up, the files are available on my GrabCAD. And I'm working on a fixture plate setup for the Carbera Air that runs either a single or dual vice setup with soft jaws. So be sure to follow if that's something that might interest you.